monkeys, this is Miss Sam. For today's lunchtime story, we are going to read a book that features a seahorse because Vivian wanted to read a book about a seahorse. So today's title is Sully the Seahorse, written by Natalie Pritchard and Natalie Marib. Down in the depths below shimmering tides lived a young seahorse who wanted to hide. Sully was so very tiny and small, he didn't feel very special at all. Oh, how he longed to be good at one thing. Sully just wished to be fast or to sing. Days were quite tough for this seahorse at school. He was known as a loser. Yes, sea life was cruel. The day had arrived that Sully so feared. The others loved it and thought he was weird. What could be happening? Just what might it be? Waves of excitement whooshed fast through the sea. Daisy the dolphin was humming a note. Pufferfish Pete was fine-tuning his bloat. Practicing dance moves and tuning guitars, it was the annual games called Sea School Stars. The contest starts soon, reminded Miss Trout. Sully felt worried and started to shout, Do I have to take part, Miss? Please say no. Yes, she replied. You should give it a go. Honk went the horn. Can you please get in place? Miss Trout said, time for the swimmer's big race. Sully cried, no, I'm going to lose. Daisy just laughed and looked 